traffic control. It's not only the hub of any large modern airport facility, but it's one of the most popular degree specializations offered at the John D. Odegaard School of Aerospace Sciences. After all, as students in the program point out, the next best thing to flying aircraft is telling them where to go. And when it comes to one of the best places to study air traffic control, the Odegaard School is the place to go. Air traffic control is one of four Bachelor of Science degree programs offered by the school and is fully accredited. The ATC program, which began in 1991 with seven students and modest facilities, has experienced phenomenal growth, both in size and reputation. Well, I think our next big step in, in the air traffic control program is to, to continue growing, um, to continue with our technological advances that we have in our simulations so that the students that we, we get here at UND are, are the best prepared we're the number one ranked school in the nation, and to maintain that takes a lot of work. The school's air traffic control facilities now feature a 220-degree tower simulator with outstanding visual and voice-activated capabilities and a 360-degree wraparound simulator, which is integrated with fully staffed center and approach simulator positions. The facility is able to simulate real-world operational conditions at the busiest airports in the world and the $2 million state-of-the-art voice-activated radar simulator is capable of simultaneously placing students in a real-time, real-world control environment. Students learn all the skill sets and operating procedures for tower, radar, and non-radar ATC from some of the most experienced professionals in the business. The Odegaard School recognizes that being a leader in aviation education requires becoming a leader in a variety of disciplines and specialties. And that careers in aviation, such as air traffic control, can be just as exciting, just as challenging, and just as rewarding as any other career in the big, bold beyond. <laughs>